Recording. Alrighty, we're one tenth away from Bellaterre. Here's the uh, entrance. And to your right. 121 Sunny Lane. It's a dirt road. I love dirt roads after I clean my motorcycle. It's really awesome. So they have a bistro. That's awesome. Looks like they have a food truck here too. There's some other people riding here too today. Let's see. No outside beverage, parking deliveries. Where are we gonna go up on top or down here? There's a bike up there. So we go. I usually park down here, away from everybody. Oh, let's go up here. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, the best bistro is brand new. Yeah. And same with the food trucks. Yeah, food trucks. It's all neat. So, reserved area. So yeah, we'll go down to the bottom again. Additional parking. Oh, we can go right down here. Don't worry about her, cause she she has a key and am. She can go backwards anytime she wants. Me. I'd like to be a little bit more particular where I park. All right. Talk to you later, be the rider PA. All righty. Well, hello there, YouTube. We're here at the Belterra. As you see when we come in, they got a food truck, they got a bistro. It's a nice area, some old housing, got a big facility, got plenty of parking. I think they do weddings and all that stuff too. So. We're gonna go inside here. Go inside here and see what we got. See what they got. See how it tastes. All that good stuff. So, we'll be back in a minute. Hey, how are you? Yeah, how are you? Having fun. That's awesome. Hey. We love when people have fun. Oh yeah. yeah. Great time. <laughs> Go drink some wine. One of many. One of many. All right, we're gonna check this place out. At least it's nice and cool. So. Tasting stations. So, all right. So we're gonna come here and give us some tastings. All right. You gotta keep your mask off when you do this. Or? Uh, you're allowed to take it off. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, good. Just when you're up here. All right. I guess we have to put a retractable holes for straws or something. Yeah, that's what I forget. The guy that was just in here before said he saw a guy that had like a thing rigged to his sleeve. So when he lifted his sleeve, it had a flap. And so like... Everybody comes up with something. Yeah. That's for sure. All right. Their wine is awesome. We got Their several. sangria is fantastic. They have cider. They also, also have ciders too. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> it really is. Um, um, yeah, here, let me see. You know what? I want to try the uh, violet, the blackberry cider. Yes. I'm trying the wrestling. wrestling. We have one that's a semi sweet and one that's totally dry. Right. Semi sweet. Semi sweet? So, got a nice little tasting of wines here. What's up? I'm, I'm talking to my YouTube. Uh, do you know if Pink Brewing Company's open or are they still closed? Um, I have no clue, but I can ask my brother. Okay. Yeah, because I was trying to get them, I text them. <laughs> What's the name of it? Cake Brewing. They're up on um, Champion Field. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Nice smell to it. This is the violet cider. Yeah, violet cider. Look at that. Oh, it's great. Blueberry. Blueberry. Oh, blackberry and sweet. No idea you did. Okay. Not a problem. Wrestling's a little dry for me. You can try wrestling. I'll try it. Oh. Cool. Look, it was sweet.
plushies. And you got the hard ciders in cans. And they got the t shirts. Cool. Something different. Are you going to be drinking this while you're here? Would you like a bag? To take it in? Yeah, take a bag. Yeah. So we got a wine growler right here. They no, sell them. That's a cider growler. A cider growler. So they sell a bottle for nine bucks. No, and then, no. then nine bucks to fill it. When you come back, get filled for nine bucks. He's on his. All righty, that was Bella Terra. Um, yeah, a lot of dry wines on my taste. She likes those more than I do. Um, the ciders wasn't bad, but still they're very dry. <laughs> they some weren't so dry, but they were kind of flattened off. You know, just had like a I call it a neutral flavor at the end of it. So it did come out pretty good. Um, really nice place. The tasting wise, eh, the, the decor is pretty plain compared to most places I've been to, some of them. But uh, it's still a nice cool air conditioned building. It's really comfortable. They have nice outside day and they have the bistro over there. And I imagine it's pretty good food too. So it seemed like a lot of people are sitting out there eating. And there's even more people showing up now after church to come out and get some food. And they probably, have, I can hear a band in the background. So some, probably somewhere to go to and hang off for the afternoon, drink some wine. There's another place we'd like to go to uh, but sometime we'll go back over and do a tasting there because we never did a video for that place yet. Check it out. So, alrighty. Alright. All right. So this is, uh, where are we going to next? Stone Villa. We're going to the Stone Villa next. So, it's not too far from here. Yeah. Um, see what's going on there and try some tasting there and see how it goes. So, we'll be back. We're out.